Hey, YouTubers, radio hobbyists. So, how easy is it to get the MCHF clone, or the RS918 as it's also known, how easy is it to get it set up on digital and, and working on digital modes? That's what this video is about. Stay tuned. So, Hooking this radio up to my uh, Windows 10 machine was dead easy. It was way simpler than I thought it was going to be. And even though this radio has all kinds of different um, um, plugs for inputs and outputs and that sort of thing for audio, all it took was one cable, and that's this one I'm showing here with the, uh, the, the USB one there below. So one cable, and I was up and running on digital modes. So let's have a look at how um, I configured. Um, let's look at uh, FT8. Um, that's you know a common mode. So let's look at how I uh, configured um, WSJTX. So I already have a couple of radios configured with my um, software here. So here's what I've done: clone, taken one of my already things, and now I'm going to rename it to MCH. F. All right, so now I have a new configuration. Let's switch to it. And then we go under File, Settings. So a couple of things we have to do is change the radio. Um, I'm going to use a Yaesu 918. Um, and we must pick the COM port that was picked up. I know mine was COM8. Uh, test the, the cat, and if it goes green, that means it worked. And push to talk even works. Wow, like simple as that. I'm surprised. Um, forgot to do something here. The audio. So we need to find where the audio is. And you'll see that it says... Um, where is it on the list here? There it is. So, MCHF, that looks like that. Perfect. That should be all there is to it. And let's look at my spectrum. And indeed, we are starting to see signals come through on the spectrum. Let's see if we decode. It's decoding already. Very easy. So um, this is all that needs to be done on the um, PC side. There's going to be some tweaking that needs to be done on, um, you know, things with audio levels, perhaps. So let's see it in action. I'm transmitting now. My ALC is sort of mid. I haven't changed any settings, so this is the default audio settings. I don't think this guy can hear me. So I'm going to uh, change this to sending out some CQs. Hang on a second. Okay. I've been sending out a CQ and I've got my first response from AA7UN. Sending my Roger, Roger, Roger. I can't believe it was this easy to make this thing work. Although I suspect the audio needs a little tweaking on the transmit. The 
looks like we have to go around another time. And there's my 73. Good. First contact with the uh, RS918 clone. Uh, thanks for watching the video.